As Granite Staters prepare for all that snow, the Manchester Animal Shelter is asking people to protect their pets. Freezing temperatures, gusting winds, and heavy snow can be deadly to your pets. Your best bet is to give them a warm spot in the house. WMUR's Mike Cronin joins us live now with more tips. Mike. Well, Stephanie, it may be hard to tell, but very light snowflakes have just started to fall here outside the Manchester Animal Shelter. And once it's all said and done, parts of the state could see more than a foot of snow. That, of course, is more headaches for people. But let's not forget about your four legged friends. The Manchester Animal Shelter has some tips for pet owners, including make sure you're using pet safe ice melt, as the regular ice melt can burn cats and dogs' paws. If you have a fence, you'll want to make sure the snow banks are low enough so that your animals can't run up the snow banks and jump over the fence. The shelter has actually seen a couple cases where pets have escaped by doing just that. And maybe most important, bring your pets inside and give them a warm spot. This weather can be dangerous for them, especially where it's been so cold over the past couple of weeks. Even if they're used to being outside, they really need to be taken in, um, you know, and um, given a spot in the house or even in the garage if they, if they do stay out all the time. Well, just the other day, the shelter says that someone brought in a 15 year old black lab who had actually gotten stuck in a snowbank. The dog was able to get over the fence, which had been knocked down in its yard. Luckily, that dog is okay and back home, but really, that just shows you how dangerous these snowbanks can be, even for pets. Live in Manchester, Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.